Good morning, everyone. It's Coach O'Neill of Fitness Preacher, OB Fit 44 Strong. This morning, honestly, this morning, something clicked. It hit me. It said to me, hey, how can you trust God when you're sleeping in the midnight hours with your eyes shut, but you can't trust him when your eyes are wide open? Is it because we put too much faith and trust in man and we don't know who our creator is or we don't have a personal relationship with God? Let me tell you this, ladies and gentlemen, for what I've been through, for what I've gone through for 44 years on this earth, man, ain't nobody, nobody can take me away from God. I don't care what it is, even if they put my life on it. I don't care what it is. I will never give God up. So what you got to understand this, look around, you're still alive. Look at where God has taken you from and where he has placed you. You see, we don't call. We, God, God did not put problems in our hands. We the one that choose to go out there and get these problems and take them on. So I'm asking you and I'm telling you this, ladies and gentlemen, stop trusting and believing in man. Start putting your trust and faith in God. That's the only way you can survive this world. No man. No matter what, it does not matter how much they have, how much money, material things, how educated they are. You got to put your trust and faith in God. Man will lead you astray. I'm letting you know, man will bring you to the bottomless pit. They will try to give you everything and try to please you. But no man, no man. And when I'm talking man, I'm talking people. All right. No man cannot give you what God can give you. So I'm telling you this, ladies and gentlemen, you got to keep the faith. You got to trust God day in and day out. Trust him. Believe in him. You go to sleep at nighttime. You don't even know what's going on around you. You don't even know how God send the angels to ward the evil ones away from your home and your family. And you wake up in the morning having doubts and fear. Come on now. And then you're the first one to say, I can do all things through Christ Jesus who strengthened me. But when the time comes for you to do it, you move away. God ain't the problem. We're the problem. 